Okay, uh, here's my pickups for today. Um, today, I went to about three sales, hardly anything to buy, but I did find three uh, Morris Katz paintings. Uh, two of them are clown, one of them is a seascape. I actually bought this off of a vendor I know. He usually works a, a market that I go to, and he wanted 60 for the three, which is fair, but I said, look, if I'm going to resell them, um, if I took them to the flea markets, I'd only get maybe 20 to 30 at most for them. And that's really hard. It's hard to get um, for Morse Cats, even though he is listed. Um, so I offered him 35 and he was like, fine. You know, actually his wife was like, take it, you know. So um, anyway, uh, for, for my $35, I got um, two clown paintings, which you see here. And I think I'm going to put these on eBay, because if I took them to the flea market, I'd only get, um, I think I'd only get about like 30 to 40 40 for the pair, and I honestly, I wouldn't sell them at a flea market for less than like maybe 60, 60 to 70 is what I'd like to see off it, because I mean, he's a listed artist, he's famous, he's prolific, whatever. Um, this is the Seascape um, that I got, and this one I don't think I'll put on eBay, because if I put it on eBay, I'd, I'd, it, to do the work, I'd want like at least 70, um, you know, because shipping and eBay fees, and that means I would make about, you know, after I did everything. I don't know, 40 or something. Um, so I think I'm going to take it to a flea market. If I can flip this for like 30 uh, to 40, I'll be satisfied with that. But And, and that's iffy for me because sometimes, I, you know, if I'm selling like original artwork by famous artists for that little, you know, I say to myself, you know what, who cares? I'll just keep them. But anyway, um, these are my finds for today. Uh, you know what, let me, I'll t tell a little bit more. He usually paints, it, paints his paintings on masonite. Um, that's, one, that's one thing he generally always does. And um, uh, this one, I did not show it, uh, but it has some information on Morris Katz, the artist on the back. And you, you can see these. Uh, he puts them on a lot, but generally he just kind of glues them on, and they fall off. So that's why most of his paintings uh, don't have them. Anyway, um, that's my findings for today.